Hey everybody, it's Faith from Firesign Terror. Hope everybody's well. So, figured I needed a change of scenery. Maybe it would help me get in the mood to read. So, we're chilling out on the day bed today. Aries, let's get you done for April 2022. See if I can get anything to fly out. What do we have? Three of Wands reversed and the world. All right. You know what that says to me? Y'all walking away from the dock, letting something end. You have waited something out. And you're no longer waiting. Nice. Okay. Well. Two. And give me one more. One more. Huh. Okay. That's slightly better. I can live with that. Okay. Mm. Oh, friends, why? Sun reversed at the bottom of the deck. Well, you're not thrilled. It's not ideal. Mm. Make it a final judgment call. Ultimately, I see whatever you're no longer waiting on. You, you, you're walking away from it altogether. But not without giving it one last go. What? Okay. Okay, let's get the energy of the person you're dealing with. Person, situation, you know, whatever. It's still very generic. Might be a Libra involved. Maybe a Leo. A little bit of everybody, really. Nine of Cups reverse decided it wanted to pop out. Could be having some addiction issues. I can't shuffle this regularly anymore, so. Oh, what do we have? Temperance, possibly Sagittarius involved in the mix somewhere. So no matter what happens, it is all for the greater good. And there'll be rainbows after the storm. Just gotta let the storm pass. That's how I'm reading that. Okay. Patience. This may call for patience, Aries. I know, not your strong suit. Sun reversed. Everybody's reversed, wow. Mm. Yeah, you try to rebuild this. I feel like to no avail though. Ten of swords reversed, tower reversed. Intentions toward each other. Eight of Cups reversed at the bottom of the deck. There's a return coming. Oh boy! I've learned to not ask questions. How you feel about them, justice, justice. For practical, simple tarot purposes, that's balance, just, fair. Can also indicate a legal attachment of some kind. Can 
I get one on that? Who went on Justice? Hi. Ooh, High Priestess reversed. Mmm, okay. All right. Six of Swords reversed. Three swords reversed, ace of pentacles reversed. A lot of songs playing on the jukebox right now. Static's running over itself. When they got away. Egos got involved here. When they got away? Why is the Three of Swords here? For what you think of them. Three of Swords, Nine of Wands reverse, throw in the towel. Give up. Full reverse. So there's a lack of trust here. There's trust issues. Couldn't jump, didn't jump. Fearful. Why is the Ten of Swords here? For Aries' intended actions. Why the Ten of Swords reversed? Ace of Cups upright. Wow. So we're going to put off the ending of something painful to try to refill a cup. Okay. Ten of Pentacles reversed. Bottom of the deck is the Nine of Cups. But why? Hermit reversed. Five of swords reversed at the bottom of the deck. I feel like for some of you, trying this again is easier than putting yourself back out there. If that makes any sense to anybody. And sometimes we get into those little comfort zones where we stay in situations that we know aren't healthy and we know aren't good for us because it's comfortable and because it's safe. And I know that sounds super weird, but we do it all the time. It's part of the human experience, I feel like, for some of us. Can I get one on this judgment card, please, universe? One on this judgment card. Hi. Just reversed. Mm, ah. That is interesting. I feel like it's the final judgment call, but somebody's trying to talk you out of it.
Queen of Wands reversed. Yeah. Jaded. Jaded and angry. Somebody doesn't want to let go here. Hmm. All right. Before I address this Eight of Cups, the moving on, finally moving on, let's address what's going on over here. Talk to me about this Two of Swords reverse. This is how they feel about you. That indicates indecisiveness. Clarity has to say. Ten of Cups reversed. Ten of Swords reversed. Emperor reversed. <laughs> they feel like you're out of control. They see you as out of control. You don't know what you want. That's how they feel about you. What are they thinking? Why is the Ace of Cups reversed here? <clears throat> the Sun. Knight of Swords. Ten of Wands. First Knight of Swords. Excuse me, I should probably go address that, whatever that is. Hold on one second. Oh gosh, I apologize. Every once in a while, the drain does that. It's probably time for some uh, tree root killer and some root axe to throw that out there. Um, where was I? Nine of Swords, Empress, Ten of Wands, Knight of Swords, Sun on top of an Ace of Cups reversed. What do they think of you? Anxiety ridden? Overall, the hap, you know, overall the catch. There's potential for growth, but the cups have been spilled one too many times. This became burdensome. And a cause of a lot of stress and anxiety, probably more than it was worth. A little bit of a mirror here. Because, you know, you see them as constantly brokenhearted and skittish. It's kind of throwing the towel in all the time. Weird. Okay. Talk to me about this tower reversed for their intended actions. Talk to me about this tower reversed. Why is the tower reversed here? Nine of Wands. Lovers reverse, three of cups reversed, no lie. This feels like a moment. This feels like a moment. This feels like a, okay, I'll half ass rebuild it, but. What on this Knight of Wands? That's like the party pony. Rides in, gets what they want, rides out again. Seven of Cups, Nine of Cups. I'm telling you now, they don't see you as a tenth cup. This is somebody that wants to explore their options. It's you're almost mirroring each other. This is crazy. So just throwing this out there. It's another one of those. Oh, Ace of Swords at the bottom of the deck. That that's convenient. It's another one of those. Okay, I'll try it again. But if it doesn't work out, it's fine because I'm keeping my options open anyway. Because it's once again. Uh, this is just easier than putting myself back out there. Whoa. 
Why is the sun reversed here? That's a revelation. Moon reversed. This is clearly something painful that just needs to end. Eight of Wands reversed. It's moments of revelation. Wheel of Fortune reversed. Five of Pentacles, bottom of the deck. Wow, okay. That tells me something. This is a moment. This is just a moment. I don't want to say a huge waste of time. And if you are in a situation where it's a, okay, we'll try it again, it's not a waste of time. Not by any means. It's the clearing of the air. It's the leveling of the playing field. It's the, okay, let's do what we need to do on a karmic level or on a soul level just to be done with it. And if this is the chapter, this is the chapter, and this is how I'm feeling about this. Ultimately, I see it coming back together because one or the both of you just aren't happy apart. That doesn't mean you're necessarily going to be happy together, especially if you weren't happy together the first time, just throwing that out there. Let's just put the gallon of milk back in the fridge and see how long it's going to take to turn to cottage cheese. If you're into cottage cheese, personally, I'm not. I mean, every once in a while, but, you know, probably a bad analogy, but you get what I'm saying. How long do you wait around for something that wasn't so good and to turn into something good again? It doesn't always work that way, especially in relationships. All right, talk to me about this Eight of Cups. Talk to me about Aries and this Eight of Cups as an ultimate conclusion. King of Pentacles. Pardon me. Five of Wands reversed. Tower reversed at the bottom of the deck. I feel like this is rebuilding your tower where you want it built, how you want it built. No longer dealing with the confrontation with this person and really coming into your own and deciding what you want. King of Pentacles. So. Star reversed for them. That's a lack of healing. Page of Wands. Five of Cups. Feels like someone has some growth to do. Page of Swords. Ace of Swords again at the bottom of the deck. So. They're still at page level. You're all the way up here. This is like one step below the Emperor, by the way. They're still like way down on page level. They're still learning. Maybe they're not on the same soul level you are. Vibrational level. Are you willing to risk being dragged down again to try to lift them up? I think you need to find someone that vibrates at your level. Just throwing that out there. They're not there. Not saying anything against them, but it might finally be time to let this flip the way it's supposed to and end the painful cycle and start something new. But to each their own, I'm not going to tell you how to live, Aries. It's not my job. It's not what I do here. It's not my job. No, why I'm here. Okay. Gets me wisdom. Get some wisdom for Aries. No. Wisdom. Oh, hi. Loyal heart. Okay. Number 35. Three plus five is eight. Eight's kind of a theme of the day here. Eight's kind of a theme. Hmm. 
where I can find it. Fidelity, loyalty, and devotion. Evidence of loyalty will appear in your life. Others will prove they are faithful to you, and you will in turn commit fully to them. There is a sure and abiding certainty in your heart. Know that spirit is always loyal to you. No matter the outer circumstances in your life, trust and have faith. For you are eternally loved and divinely protected and divinely directed. That's your oracle message. Here's your relationship message. Your partnerships, friendships, and romantic relationships all have many qualities in common right now. Honest devotion, faithfulness, and a loyal heart are being shown to you. Yours Are you as loyal in return? Now is the time for heartfelt commitments and trusting in divine protection. And here's what I'm taking out of that. If something has repeatedly not worked out, there's probably a reason for it. Remember, sometimes rejection is protection. Okay? All right, guys. Sorry for the delay. I'm finally starting to feel better, and I'm able to be in one position long enough to be able to read cards. So hopefully I can get April rolling and close the month out before the very end of the month. So take care. Know that you are loved. Be blessed. I send you off with peace, love, and light, and I will catch you next time, whenever next time may be. Enjoy the rest of your April and have a lovely day.